What's up guys? It's Ava. Hey y'all, it's Caitlin. And today we have a Ulta. Oh, I'll just say Ulta mukbang. <laughs> we have an Ulta mukbang. We no. have an Ulta haul. And we just went to Ulta, picked up a few things, yeah. picked up a few treats, and we're going to show you all what we got. Yes, so excited. Okay, so I want to start with my... What I got, I was super excited about it. It's yes. the Ulta Beauty Adva Advanced Cleansing Dual Action Facial Cleansing System. Yes. So it's like a little cleansing brush um, that you can do your facial. Yeah, I have one of these too. It's like you just scrub your face with it and it just like goes around. It's like a Clarisonic or something like that. Yeah. And you just scrub, 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 yeah. scrub. And it does so good with like really cleansing your face. And I, if you have makeup on, I recommend doing this after you like take off your makeup just for a real deep extra cleanse yeah i think it's good and i'm excited because it includes one rotating brush and then two brush heads one normal mm -hmm. and one foam so i'm super excited and i'll let you guys know yeah. what i think about it so yeah that's yeah. the first thing i got that's her first thing mm -hmm. so the first thing i picked up was this philosophy um what is it uh ready set glow skin renewing trial set mm -hmm. and I was super excited about this because I heard really good things about philosophy and this comes with the one step facial cleanser, the day moisturizer renewed hope in a jar, in a jar, <laughs> in a jar. <laughs> in a jar. <laughs> and then renewed hope in a jar nighttime moisturizer and then the micro delivery exfoliating face wash. So I've used the micro delivery exfoliating face wash before and I love it. I think it is so good for your skin. But that was the only thing from Philosophy I had ever tried. And somebody told me that their cleanser was super good. So I'm excited about this. Like, I'm really excited to try it. Yeah. So and I, I think the Purity Cleanser is actually the number one cleanser in America. They had said something like that. That was what they said it. on Ulta. Yeah, so I'm super excited to try it. And I hope, and I was looking for moisturizer, so this was like perfect because I wanted another cleanser. And I love this, uh, like micro delivery exfoliating face wash. Mm -hmm. And I needed more moisturizer, so I was like, okay, this is like perfect. Yeah. I was so happy about that. Okay. So, yeah, that was the first thing I picked up. So, I'm super excited to try this. If this is good, I will definitely be doing like a review and let y'all know if I like it or not. And the next thing I got was the Mario Badescu Vitamin C Serum. Mm -hmm. So I've actually gotten this before and I really liked it, but I haven't used it in a while, so I picked up another one. Ooh, so, yeah. is there a vitamin C serum good? I, I have a vitamin like C serum from Amazon, and it's, it's true. Yeah, I, I, I also had that one, but you know, I like this one better. So yeah. Badescu. Mario Badescu. So the next pickup I got, I got a lot of lip glosses, y'all. I don't know why. I just am obsessed with A gloss gal. Yes. So I got this Buxom Full On Plumping Lip Polish in the shade Dominique. And I've used this before like a long time ago. And when I went to Ulta, I was like, okay, let me pick this up again because it's so good. And it's super pretty. It's like a clear. Let me take it out of the packaging. It's like a clear, like shimmer shade. I don't know if y'all could see. Cause you think it will focus on it? I don't know. Anyway, it's a clear shimmer shade. So it's super pretty. Like if you line your lips or have like lipstick or something on top, but you want a glossy finish and a plumping effect, this is it. Like this is super duper pretty. You can wear it by itself or you can put it on top of something. But yeah, this is a great lip gloss. So I definitely have to pick it up again. So this was my second purchase. Okay, or second thing I picked up. So I'm about to show y'all my holy grail of all things. So I already mentioned in our everyday makeup routine that I love lashes. My all-time favorite lashes are the Kiss 4 Plus 1 Lashes, I think it's called. I really don't know. Ever Easy Lashes. Ever Easy Kiss. Bring the salon home. Okay. Yeah, 4 Plus 1 Kiss, Wispies, this is it. So this is the lashes. I love them. They come with a little applicator, even though I don't use the applicator to put on my lashes, but mm -hmm. it comes with one in case you do. Mm -hmm. And it comes with one, two, three, four, five, five pairs. Mm -hmm. That is a steal. That's a steal. So yeah, Pick, picked up at Ulta. I think you could also get it at Amazon, but Ulta also. Yeah, this is my third purchase. So 
so to keep on with lashes, I also picked up some lashes. Now, Ava definitely wears lashes more than I do. Mm -hmm. So I don't usually get like them in bulk because I don't wear them that often. Yeah. But my favorite type of lashes are the Ardell Professional 3D Faux Mink Multi-Dimensional Lightweight Invisiband Lashes. And I love these because I feel like they look super not natural natural but they're like they're more on the natural side of false lashes. yeah they're like, natural for false yeah and i love how like it looks like hair because it's a faux mink like i just think it's so beautiful and these are like my favorite lashes yeah ardell faux mink there's different styles though because this is the um i think these are wisps are these wispies yeah those are wispies yeah and sometimes i buy the demi wispies but um yeah ardell faux mink that is my favorite style lash because I think it just looks so beautiful on and it still is natural and not too dramatic of a lash, which I'm not always a fan of a like big dramatic. Right. Yeah, lash. she don't like the dramatic look. Yeah. With the lashes. Like it was too If it's too, too much extra. then I I think it's because I don't wear them often. So yeah. if it's like too extra, I'm like right. I don't like the feel of it and I don't like the look of it. Yeah. But I mean if you can pull off dramatic lashes, go ahead, girl. But I don't think like I can. Okay, so my next thing I got, and this was actually a really popular item at Ulta. It's the Their Real Beyond Mascara from Benefit. And so somebody put me onto this. I have yet to try it, but I want a good mascara because I want to stop using fake lashes all the time. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to try this out. I'm going to let y'all know what I think about it. But this is a very popular. Yeah, and I think that is super popular because like on, even on the side, it was like, um, wait, where's English? Where's English? <laughs> oh, 94% of people saw dramatic length and volume. 90% of people saw base to tip curl. And then 94 saw visible lift. And 100% saw long, wear long wearing results. So this has good statistics. Yeah. On so the yeah, we're going to see how this goes. Yeah. And hopefully it's a good yeah. mascara. I have it. I really like it. Okay. So See, I'm not a mascara girl. I'm a lashes yeah. girl. So if I get put on some mascara, it's because of this. Yeah. Sorry, we'll see. So the next, I'm gonna just show y'all all the rest of the glosses because I have like three more glosses. I don't know why. I'm gonna just show them to So the three glosses I got, I got Kylie's high gloss in the shade clear, and this is super pretty. I just want to get a gloss because, I mean, I want to get Kylie's gloss because they just look pretty, and I wanted one. But I just, I like clear glosses most of the time. Like, I like shimmer sometimes, but I'm not too into, like, excessive shimmer or whatever. And this is, like, a super pretty, like, it's clear, but it has, like, a pinkish tint to it. And I thought that was so pretty. So, yeah, I got that. So, I'll let y'all know what I think about this. But, yeah, that's one of the, just the regular glosses I got. And then I just got this Ulta Jelly Gloss Lip Gel. So, this is literally just a topper. Like, this is clear gloss like beauty store and you probably gonna get from beauty store mm -hmm. so this is just a clear topper to put on like if you have on like a mad lipstick or something or just lip liner and you want to put a topper on i don't know why i keep getting the same type of glosses Gloss. Her, but she loves clear glosses i love clear gloss so much and i don't know i literally have so many and i every time i go to like also like the beauty store or something like that i'm buying more and i'm like for what but you, you can never go wrong. You can never go wrong with clay. You can always wear it. Yeah. So I don't know. And then I have another pretty much clear gloss. But this is not a gloss. This is actually Ulta Beauty Juice Infused Lip Oil. And I had been wanting to try this because I heard really good things about it. And it's supposed to be it's a lip oil, so it's like a treatment for your lips. So I feel like it gives it that glossy effect, but it's healing and like giving your lips moisture and everything so I feel like it's a win-win so I got the jojoba and peach so I hope that smells good I haven't really smelled it yet but we'll see but yeah so I got the jojoba and peach juice infused lip oil so that was all of my like gloss purchases I guess okay and then I got the Smith's Rosebud so, yeah. so this is the balm that Katie had in the everyday makeup routine. I really wanted to try it out, so we'll see how it goes. But yeah, this is the good. smell of that is so good. Like if yeah. you like rose scented things, she said the smell is really is good. It is so good. Like the rose, I said, love. Yeah, like, it feels good on your lips. Yeah, it's yeah. just like really moisturizing. But I, the, my favorite part about it is the smell. Mm -hmm. Like the rose smell is just like 
relaxing. I also have, they have it in a tin as well. It comes in that in little tin, and I love the little tin because I love to just smell it. It's, okay. I love so, it. Yeah. It's so good. I'm excited to try it. Yeah. So then um, I'm going to go by Brand Next, which is stuff I got from NYX. So I just wanted another brown liner because I think I had ran out of the one I had, and then my other liners are like nude or like pinky brown and I just wanted a plain simple brown liner mm -hmm. so this is NYX uh, professional lip pencil it's just a regular lip pencil in brown and then I got the NYX soft matte lip cream in Lyon and this was super pretty I saw this on a YouTube video once I forgot who a YouTube video I was watching but it was so pretty and it's like a it's like a brown, but it's still like a nice, it's like a, I don't know how to describe it, like a mauve brown. Oh yeah, like It's just Malvi. super pretty, like it looks oh mature, yeah. it looks like, if you're going for like a nice little like but, natural look, but still a little, mm, a yeah. little something, this is a great color to go for. I also noticed that when you use mauve, like undertones, like pinkish mauve or whatever, it makes your lips appear bigger too. Oh, it does. At least I think so. Cause yeah. when I buy lipsticks that color, I I feel like I can tell. Yeah, but no, it's just super pretty and still like like gives you a little spice, but it's still super natural. And, and that's what I like exactly. Like, oh, this is not just like plain and basic and clear, mm -hmm. but it's still subtle and still natural. Yeah. So and I feel like these would probably go really good together. Yeah, that's a good combination. And then like a. A pinky mauvey brown yeah, yeah. goes, and then put a little bit of that clear gloss on top. Uh, ooh, we're really getting the party started. I love, love. Okie dokie. So then I got the hold on, it's in here. The witch hazel and lavender toner. Mm -hmm. I love lavender scented things, especially from Mario Badescu's skincare line. But I also love witch hazel toner. So just combining the two, I'm really about to see. Is it see. good? I don't know. I'm going to try it. I've never tried it. I think it like just came spray? out. Oh, it did? Yeah. Is, is it, it like the spray, spray or no? It's, it smells just like the spray. Least, I think. It does smell like the spray. I love it. It's, it's, it's a very natural lavender scent. And oh, yeah. I love it. And I also, did, I think they have the witch hazel and um, rose water one too. Oh, they do? Yeah. So oh. I might see what that one's about too. I, I have the um, Thayer's witch hazel. That's what I have. You have yeah. that? Yeah. So oh, yeah, let me know about that because that was so good. It smells I like really good. And I love using lavender stuff at night. Like me when too. I get out the shower, I'm about to go to bed, I spray that Mario Badescu just for the smell of it because I'm like, mm. I think because lavender helps you sleep. Sleep, it yeah. does. Lavender helps you sleep. So yeah, so I'm so super excited about that one. Yes. Let's see how it goes. And then my last little pickup from today was this goat milk. It's nature's original. Dianis Goat Milk Skincare Balance Moisturizer Goat Milk Hand Cream. This stuff smells so good. I don't usually like use hand creams, mm -hmm. but this stuff smells. What is this really good? Let me take the top off. Zoe's friend had this. No, I smell Zoe's friend had. Oh really? And yeah. It was good. It smells so good. Oh, it does. Is it? And I don't know why, but I love, like like I said, I don't always do hand creams, but if I have a hand cream, I love the ones that smell good because I feel like when you shake people's hand and I, I speak with my hands, so yeah. if you have like a good fragrance on your hands and you speak yeah. and that's like going around people's faces and stuff like that, yeah. like they'll be like, ooh, that smell good. Yeah. I like if you shake people's hands and they smell like you yeah. smell good. And I love, we're going to do that, a fragrance. Oh, we gonna do a fragrance video. That's a like one. the best. Cause I love things that smell I good. I love shit that smells good. So like the best perfumes, the best little oh, bodies, yes. body butters, butters, or butters or butter. or whatever. Yeah. we're gonna do a fragrance one. Oh, yeah, yeah, because I'm so I love that. But no, yeah, and this was on clearance too. So I think it was like a dollar. Oh, good. I don't know, but it smells so good. Yeah, I'm a sucker for things that smell good and then that feel good on the skin. Yes. So, and this is good because this is goat milk and this is parabian free, cruelty free, dermatologist tested. And it's like good for your skin and it smells good. So I'm super excited to eat them. Ooh. But yeah, that was my last little, little goodie from Ulta today. Okay, so my little last pick me up is something I'm super interested in and excited to try. 
It is the It Your Skin But CC Color Correcting Full Coverage Cream. It's also anti-aging and hydrating serum. And it has an SPF of 50. Which is awesome. Yeah. So, it's kind of like foundation, but a lighter foundation. So, in case you wanted, you didn't want to put foundation on that day, using CC cream would probably be your biggest bet. Because it has SPF. It's not too much on your skin. It's kind of lightweight. So, I'm excited to try it. Yes, and I am in the shade Rich. So yeah, this is what yeah. I'm super excited to try. I have, like I said, I have that little glossy one, but that's super lightweight coverage. And I didn't know that one said full coverage. So that's like a foundation. But that's like, foundation, yeah. yeah. But it's like not as heavy as yeah. my as normal foundation. foundation. Yeah. That's awesome. So yeah, I'm super excited to yeah. try it. And this stuff like that that has SPF in it is perfect, perfect because then that could be not an everyday thing, but like you could do something like that every yeah. other day because it's a moisturizer, moisturizer kind of mm -hmm. and it has SPF and it gives you coverage like mm -hmm. that is really good so I definitely want to know what you think about that yeah I might have to get that like it and that is all I got that is all we got today y'all from our little mini Ulta haul we were super excited to go and get some stuff yeah. and we hope y'all like what we got let us know like when y'all go to Ulta what do y'all pick up let us know if y'all tried any of the things we got and what y'all thought about them and just let us know in the comments, like, anything else. Yeah, think. exactly. Yeah. So, we're definitely going to be coming soon with a fragrance video. Oh, yeah. That was, or, that like, was how to idea. smell good yeah. all day video. Because, oh, my goodness. We love smelling good. Yeah. We love good fragrances. I would love to do a video like that. For sure. For sure, yeah. yeah. All right, y'all. Peace. Peace.